All right, lots of guys like Joey Bosa. Played at Ohio State. Browns have the number two pick. Should the Browns take him, Chris? No, they should not. Beyond the fact that they need a quarterback at number two and they're finally in a position where they're going to make the choice of getting the best guy. Like, it's not in somebody else's hands whether the Browns get the best quarterback. When's the last time they were in that kind of mm -hmm. position, bud? Maybe 1999 with Tim Couch. Um, beyond that, I don't think the Browns would be able to maximize Joey Bosa. I think they would, because they're going to run this 3-4 defense or hybrid or whatever you want to say it with Ray Horton, all I have is visions of Joey Bosa standing up and covering dudes out of the backfield or covering tight ends. To me, he's a 4-3 rush end, and I don't think that's what the Browns are going to be running here. I hate when this happens. I agree with Chris again. <laughs> um, you know, to me, you, you always say, well, they can't take a quarterback unless that guy projects as Andrew Luck, right? That's what Mike Mayock dropped that name into the conversation. Yeah. And I, I, the, I, that's a fallacy. That's ridiculous. This is just as ridiculous to say, take Joey Bosa because he'll play more downs, he'll be more ready, he'll be, he'll be a defensive factor. Listen, he doesn't fit what they want to do right now. And even if he did, I would take the quarterback first. Is he the next J.J. Watt? I don't think so. And listen, a good quarterback is equal to a great player to any other position. 